Well, hello, my radio friends. I was asked to post a video of this shell speaker, a conch shell speaker that I had made. And uh, some uh, a member wanted to see it in operation. Um, just for a little tidbit of information, if I may, um, by the late 20s, or even actually by the middle 20s, middle to late 20s, the horn speaker had fallen out of favor. And manufacturers were trying different ways of, of hiding the horn so it was less of an eyesore. And this was one of the ways in which they did so. But like I said, this is one, this is a reproduction that I made. And now let me show you the bottom side of it, if I may. This has got a Nathaniel Baldwin driver. And for what it's worth, that's an exceptional driver for most horn speaker applications if it has a bad unit underneath most commonly i put that driver inside my ak model h horns whenever i get one in the shop so it's a great replacement works well in this application as well and uh, today i'm powering it or utilizing it with my radiola 3 so and of course my amplifier let's turn the amplifier on That's a kind of a distant music station. Now we'll come over to a the third inning is the only source of offense as they lead the Marlins one nothing in the sixth. I'm Brian Sunday. Fox Sports Radio's odd couple. One guy is married, one guy is divorced, one guy has no kids. One guy has two beautiful daughters. One guy went to college in a cornfield in Ohio. One guy went to an Ivy League school in the big city. One guy spent his Sunday morning seated in the pew. The other spent it throwing money at the pole. Can these two sports writers share a radio show without driving each other crazy? From the TireRack.com Fox Sports Radio Studios, here's the odd couple. Chris Broussard and Rob Parker. It is gives you an idea it actually has surprisingly good volume i mean it plays very loud and it has pretty decent total quality for what it is i mean it's as i will say certainly the larger horns have 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 a little better tonal quality but for what this is for the size that it is i was truly truly surprised at the performance so this might be a project for some of you all, and uh, it was, wasn't was terribly, terribly difficult, and it's certainly, I think, it's something that's uh, kind of a neat little novelty I thought I'd share. Thank you so much. I, of course, appreciate you all for following along, and if you have any questions, by all means, feel free to ask. And, of course, as, as always, until next time.